Staying in the political arena, An Chul-soo is making his way around Korea to drum up support for his plans to start his own party. Pundits predict at least 10 lawmakers will defect from the party he gave up on, the NPAD, and join him. But An says he's also looking for fresh faces with a passion for reform. Lee Soo-eun has the latest on the polit politician's bold attempt to go at it alone. Former opposition leader An Chul-soo has already taken his political comeback tour on the road, following his departure from the main opposition New Politics Alliance for Democracy Party. On Tuesday, An traveled to Korea's southern port city of Busan, where he told local reporters he's seeking to build a new party of talented individuals, even if they lean conservative, as long as they're interested in his reform agenda and fulfill three criteria, be against corruption, self-contradiction and extreme conservatism. Last Sunday, An quit the party he co-founded after his efforts to reform the party and get the current leader, Moon Jae-in, to resign failed to gain momentum. While it's unclear what effect his departure will have on the political landscape, new polling suggests that it could spell trouble for the opposition, which suffered crushing defeats in the last two by-elections. In a nationwide poll by local polling agency Realmeter regarding An's departure from the NPAD, almost half of the respondents said they approved of his decision. However, in the southern provinces of Cholabukdo and Cholanamdo, considered a hotbed of support for the liberal camp, the positive response fell short of 35 percent. Analysts say that the result illustrates a regional concern over a potential splitting of the liberal vote that could lead to defeat in next year's general elections in April. Lee Soo-eun, Arirang News.